Well, Ethan, back tonight with another beer review, and what I've got tonight is Winter Ride Double Bach. 7.5% ABV. This is a dark roasted caramel with Munich malts. Uh, Bach Lager roasted with uh, dark caramel Munich malts. This is the malts that it's brewed with, not the actual taste of the beer. Best by date is June 7th, 2024, so about five months away. So well within the freshness date, so that's good. Brewed and canned by Joseph's Brow Brewing Company, San Jose, California. Uh, this was given to me, um, I believe, purchased at Trader Joe's. And I got a new Belgium glass to put it in. This gets an 82 on Beer Advocate. Go ahead and crack into it. I got this beer for Christmas, so I thought I'd go ahead and try it and don't want to sit on it too long. Here we are in the middle of January almost. Brown, very dark brown color. Uh, to you, it'll look more brown. To me, I see a little bit of red around the edges of the glass when the light touches it. Hold it up to the light a little bit. <clears throat> Foamy, one finger head, the aroma. I get that kind of typical Bach aroma. Very malty, very bready. Doesn't smell like an IPA. Doesn't smell like a, you know, American adjunct lager either. It just has a real thick, bready, I think a dark rye bread, something like that. Not like a, not like a, a white bread, but a darker bread. Very nice aroma. And seven and a half percent. It's pretty high alcohol beer. So you know that's as high as an IPA. Um, a regular Bach. Mm, this is a double. A regular would have probably you know four and a half, five percent ABV. This one seven and a half, so a good a good bit more. Oh, wow. Um, rich, bold, big flavor. Wow. Just a very upfront, biscuity maltiness. Tastes just like you would think a double bock would. A lot more biscuity breadiness than bitterness or hoppiness. Doesn't taste like a stout. Um, what could I compare this to? Um, if you've had like a Shiner Bach, similar flavor here and appearance but much bigger and bolder, like two, three times as much flavor as like a Shiner Bach. But that bready maltiness that a Shiner Bach has, you know, double or triple that, and this is kind of what this is tasting like. Really nice flavor. I'm um, I'm going through it. It's delicious, y'all. Beer Advocate goes at 82. It's much better than that. This is like a 95 for me. This is a magnificent beer. Wonderful flavor. Again, like <clears throat> not the big, thick sweetness of a stout, but certainly sweeter certainly more full-bodied 
full mouth feel than any American adjunct lager, most IPAs. Just delicious. Um, and it's a winter beer, you know, winter ride. They have the can art, you know, people, you know, kind of uh, skiing down the mountain slope, the snowy mountain slope. And this exactly fits that description. It tastes exactly how you would want a winter beer to taste. You could drink something like this at room temperature and it would be fine. It's warm, it's inviting, it's thicker, fuller bodied, lends itself better to the cooler weather, the winter months. Not something I would want to drink at the beach, at the pool in summer, but that those activities is something I would drink a Bud Light, a Miller, a Coors, but you know, something like that. This is a winter sipper. Magnificent beer for this time of year, even almost like a dessert beer, kind of like a stout, but not um, just a great beer for this time of year. I can't, I can't really say much more. It's just a great beer. Try it if you can. Double Bach Winter Ride. Cheers and thanks for watching this beer review.